Hello, welcome to our classes. I am Dr. K. K. Misra. This video tutorial is on foreign trade of India. This is part 2. Now come to the question. Question number 1. Which of the following is not a basic objective of documentation in foreign trade? So, your correct option is E. None of the above. A. To assure that exporter will receive the payment. So, this is not. And the same is about B, C and D also. Two, which of the following is not an important document in foreign trade? So here, correct option is A, a check for the value of goods. Three, dash risk is the potential exchange loss from outstanding obligations as a result of exchange rate fluctuations, A trade, B exchange, C finance, D non completion, D E transaction. Correct option is E transaction. 4. Foreign exchange risk can be reduced by using dash A forward contracts, B future contracts, C currency options, D currency denomination, E all. Correct option is E all. 5. Which of the following is not a condition for drafts to be negotiable? So, here correct option is B must contain a promise to pay. A certain sum if goods are received. 6. If a draft is made to bearer, payment should be made to dash. Correct option is D. Anyone who presents the draft. 7. If a draft is accepted by a bank, it becomes a dash. Correct option is D. Banker's acceptance. 8. Forms of counter trade include the following except. So, the correct option is. A simple barter. 9. Documentary drafts require various shipping documents such as dash A bills of lading, B insurance certificates, C commercial invoices, D A and B, E A B C. So a correct option is E A B C. 10. When IBM ships products to its subsidiary in Argentina, it will most likely use a dash draft. Correct option is B. Clean. 11. If a carrier is instructed to deliver goods to an importer, a DAS bill of lading is used. So, a correct option is A. Straight. 12. A or an DAS bill of lading does not guarantee that the goods have been loaded on the vessel. So, correct option is C. Received for shipment. Shipment. 13. Which of the following is not? true of a letter of credit. So, correct option is C at the request of the exporter. 14. If a letter of credit can be neither cancelled nor modified without the consent of all parties, it is known as dash A revolving, B irrevocable, C revocable, D unconfirmed, E unclean. Correct option is B irrevocable. 15. If an exporter is doubtful about an issuing bank's ability to pay he will expect a domestic bank to join transaction in a dash letter of credit. A. Revolving. B. Irrevocable. C. Revocable. D. Unconfirmed. Or E. Confirmed. Correct option is E. Confirmed. 16. Which of the following may be required as additional documents in a letter of credit? A. Commercial invoice. B. Insurance document, C. Consular invoice, D. Certificate of origin or E. All of the above. Correct option is E. All of the above. 17. Which of the following documents should be should necessarily accompany a draft? So, here correct option is E. None of the mentioned above at A, B, C or D. 18. A commercial invoice is issued by dash. Correct option is A. Exporter. 19. A document that contains a precise description of the goods is known as a dash. Correct option is C. Commercial invoice. 20. Which of the following is not true of a consular invoice? So, a correct option is D. Issued by the consulate of the exporting country. 21. Which of the following is not a form of offset agreements? So, correct option is D. Cash in advance. 22. Which of the following is not a form of counter trade correct option is B consignment 23 in a dash counter trade the initial seller receives compensation in products that arise out of the original sale a consignment B barter C counter purchase 
डी बाई बैक एग्रीमेंट और ई स्विच ट्रेडिंग करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज डी बाई बैक एग्रीमेंट ट्वेंटी फोर कंपनीज अकाउंट रिसिवेबल ऑन अ नॉन रिकोर्स बेसिस इज नोन एज डैस करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज सी फैक्ट्रिंग ट्वेंटी फाइव फॉलोइंग इज नॉट नेसेसरली अ पार्टी टू अ फॉरफिटिंग ट्रांजेक्शन करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज सी ब्रोकर 26 below are five steps involved in a typical trade transaction which step is out of order so the correct option is c importers bank issues the letter of credit 27 the three c's of international commerce are a customers b commitment c currency d cultural sensitivity so the correct option is e a b and d 28 when exporting some common pit falls include a failure to use an export management company b failure to print service sales and warranty messages in local languages c changing orders around the world instead of establishing a basis for profitable operations and orderly growth d failure to consider licensing or joint venture agreements e all of the above correct option is e all of the above this was all about this particular video tutorial i hope that you have liked it and if you have liked it please do not forget to subscribe my youtube channel our classes and press the bell button and pass down to others those who are needy now and in the future thank you please like and subscribe thank you very much have a nice time best of luck